Happy Valentine's Day! Oh, look what I just found. Pink beads. As far as books go, I'm still on Definitely Dead, which is the sixth Sookie Stackhouse novel, which means it's my seventh book of the year. I'm really glad now that I didn't raise my goal earlier this year because I've been on this same book for about two weeks now, so good job me for thinking ahead of on this one. I found some really old video clips that I don't know if you've seen in a long time, but I know I hadn't when I found them. Um, they don't even have sound in them because my old camera didn't take sound with the video. Mr. and Mrs. Dursley of number four, Privet Drive, were proud to say that they were perfectly normal. Thank you very much. They were the last people you'd expect to be involved with anything strange or mysterious. Because they didn't hold it such nice. Jeff and Jordan were on the amazing race tonight and they kicked butt. They were awesome. They got in first place by the end of the day and they were spectacular. A couple of the other teams started calling them for the big brother team. I just thought that was funny. Actually, now that I think about it, I don't really know why that would be funny. So my fangirl moment this week involved you because I went to Arcadia for the weekend and I had a lot of fun since, you know, I'm not like a real college student so I always enjoy going out to see you at college because I feel like I'm a real college student for a little while. We went clubbing, we were on the radio, we were on Q102 giving shout outs, we watched Shakespeare in Love, I downed a Coke Icy from Wawa faster than I've ever downed any type of liquid in my life. That's what she said. We went on chat roulette, which was interesting. <laughs> that was my first time, so that was cool. I wish I had people to go on it with here, but I don't, so. Also on chat roulette, we had a rave. We were called normal. Always a good thing, always a good thing. I still don't understand why we got nexted so many times because we were looking pretty hot and the people who nexted us were not looking hot, so I don't understand why we got nexted. I'm just saying. Why didn't they next us? Now I know what all the people we nexted felt like. Except the body parts. I don't feel bad for them. And even though we didn't get to do everything that we planned on doing this weekend, it was still a lot of fun, and that's why it was my fangirl moment of the week. So here are some pictures of us clubbing it up. Going out tonight, everybody stands I'm going to stop playing with my beads now. Uh, I really needed this weekend because... Um, because of all the snow, I was trapped in my house for like half the week, so getting out really was just a lot of fun. It was, I needed it. And now I have a ton of homework piled up because we couldn't have class last week, so I didn't do my homework for those classes naturally. So now I have all of my work that I have to have due for this week, and that's not going to be fun to do. But procrastination is best. Actually, incest is best. That's... It's a saying in my family. That sounds terrible. <laughs> incest is best as saying in my family. <laughs> like, like we have incest. Uh, we don't. My dad just said it when we were camping one time, so now we all make fun of it all the time and say incest is best that every chance possible. Which you would think wouldn't happen often, but there are a lot of reasons to say incest is best in my family for some reason. Again, that sounds pretty bad. So I got this cute idea, you know, to make the beads into a headband. I kind of got them stuck in my hair. Cute, right? Mm-hmm. That's cute. How do I get this out? I've talked for entirely too long, so it is time for me to go. I have to stop looking at myself in the computer screen. Look at the eyesight. At the eyesight. Bye, see you Wednesday. That sounded stupid, and I looked at myself. I'm still looking at myself. Chrissy, I'll see you on Wednesday.